Hello and welcome to the channel. Incredibly excited to be doing an unboxing for you guys today of the Lycaon Swift. I believe they sent me over the hub driven system, but I'm excited to see what this board is about because I've heard a lot of good things, but then also on the channel, people have constantly asked me about this particular board. So thank you like I am for sending it out so that we can test this board and see what it's all about. So let's just go ahead and open it up. I like that it comes boxed within a box and then it has the protective covers on there that we love to see because it keeps your board safe in transit. Lots of foam to protect the board. No complaints there, that looks really good. Take it out, I like that it comes in a plastic bag, keeps it further protected. And let's take this out as well. And let's just move the box to the side for now. You can go ahead and take out the board just to see what it's all about. And wow, the board looks very nice. Very, very impressive looking. Grip tape looks good. The concave looks amazing. Hub motors look good. Okay, we'll talk about that a little bit more in a second. Let's see what else we get when we purchase the board. This is pretty interesting. It's like in the shape of like a T-bone. <laughs> I haven't eaten breakfast this morning. <laughs> I'm hungry. So let's go ahead and uh, I guess open this up here. See what this is all about. And this looks like it has all of your pertinent information for the board, the charger. What type charger do we have here? 2.5 amp charger. That looks good. We have our skate tool, of course. That looks very good. We have our remote. Nice, the Hobbywing remote with the indicator screen on there. I like that. Looks like Lycaon has some of their branding and marketing on the remote. I like it when companies try to take things that may be generic and kind of make them their own, put a little nice touch on there. So that looks good. Oh, this is amazing right here. I was gonna go online and buy one of these. They gave you um, like an Allen key set that has all kinds of sizes, shapes, Man, this is going to my EDC carry. Great job right there. That put a smile on my face early this morning. And then we have, um, you know, the rest of the cables for to charge the remote and such. So all of this stuff looks amazing here. This looks really good here. Good job. Very good job so far. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Let's sit all this stuff to the side so we can talk about why we're all here today, which is this board here. This thing looks very good. Um, I'm just gonna be 100% honest just looking at it. It looks much better in person than what it looked like in the pictures. I like the concave, what I see on here, the grip tape looks really good. These wheels, wow, seem very squishy. 78A, 90 millimeter wheels, very large wheels. That's gonna probably be a comfortable ride. Then we have the hub motor system here in the back. Uh, 90 millimeter, 78A Duro as well, which is very nice. Looking at the rear here, flanker trucks, it looks like they're utilizing. The wiring and stuff in the back of the board looks pretty nice as well. Looks good. Um, this, this board actually has like the swappable drivetrain system. So you can also use belt drive on here. The enclosures for the ESC, nice shaping and design there. I like that. And then the front looks amazing. The front of this thing, the front enclosure is huge. This thing has a very large battery on it. So I'm curious to see what the range and such is gonna be. I like the way it looks. Um, I can't wait to see what it's all about because this board may be an option for the heavier guys out there. I always get questions from individuals saying, hey, look, I'm about 250, 260, what's a good board for me? And sometimes decks that are very flexible may not be a good option, but I'm thinking that this like high on board for those heavier riders might be a good option. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the unboxing there. Excited to get the board. You guys know I will put this board through its paces Tell me what you're interested in knowing, what you're interested in seeing, so I can make sure I cover those things when I do the full review. Remember, PEVs allow you to be everywhere. And as always, I'll see you at the top because the bottom is too crowded. Peace.